Don't forget to go to ashkicking.com for pound for pound the best home health and beauty fragrance products. Anything else you want to say to your fans, man? All right, man, shout out to Dante's Boxing Nation. You know, follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, Earl Spence Jr., my whole name, and just look out for me. Yes, sir. Let me dig into your brain, folks falling like no one put hands on me. We got that world champion. Hall of Fame most artists, man. I'm not the average fucking guy. Okay, okay, okay. Don't get that, don't get that mixed this is up. Be a world don't, don't get it twisted. Yeah, no, no, you just no, no, no. you just put yourself on blast. No, 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 no. I'm, no, I'm, 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 I'm messing with you. He's a UFC guy. But remember, he, he's here all the time. We've been coming here all the time. He sports several guys. Remember, training. Am I going to see you? Might be. I'm a fan. See you guys. Remember, training is is not to beat someone up. It's to get better. You know, the guy right here, Thomas, Thomas Hill, he spars with him all the time. You know? Oh, really? Yeah. That's it. You know, you know. Sparring with who? Who you talking about, dude? Kevin Lee. Oh, you know? Kevin Lee. I'm a Kevin Lee fan, man. Yeah, yeah. Remember, he's my MMA fighter. I, I love Kevin. He's my guy. But, but remember, when we bring guys here to work out, it's to train to get better. The only fight we care about is the real engagement. Yeah. Training is training. Don't don't get it mixed. No, I, I understand completely. Yeah, you know, so training is training. But, but, so but, but he boxes well. So he, much, uh, he boxes well when he's sparring with these guys. You know, um, and, and that's it. You know, no, I, 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 I'm, I'm I pleased with what, what goes like, on. Team, I just like uh, I figure every once in a while maybe the egos might collide because uh, you got so so many alphas here. That uh, but it, but remember, one thing about fighting fighting is the simplest form of of, of, of the answer. You see it right there live. Yeah. So it don't matter about the fucking ego you got. When you get in the ring and you start fighting, we know who won and who lost after each round. So yeah. that's what it boils down to. It's not about ego and all that. It's about after the fight's over, you know if you did well or if you did. So you Your gotta, trainers know if you did well. You got a prediction for my Mayweather fight, man? Knockout. Connor's going, going to sleep five to seven rounds. Oh, uh, that's great. Five, seven, five or seven? Five, two, seven. Five, two, seven. five six, or Under seven. Under that or five, six, or seven? I said five, six, or seven. All right, that's right. Right. There it goes. We got inside right here. Five, six, seven. I'm going to drop stacks on that. Right on. Nice meeting you, Yeah, it's a pleasure, man. Thanks so much. All right. Tell Kevin Lee a, a fan drop by, man. Yeah, we will. Uh, he'll be here on Wednesday. He'll be here on Wednesday. Kevin Lee will be here on Wednesday? Yeah. Okay. Matter of fact. Don't be on Wednesdays, Fridays. Okay. That's what it is, man. All right, Dewey. So who'd you work with today, man? I mean, you be training everybody. So who'd you um, train? I uh, just I just had Sanjar Rockman up, my Mayweather Promotions fighter. Uh, he's fighting, you know, on, on, on the big show. Um, I also trained Kylie Fulmer. She's a female boxer from Australia. Um, and my fighter, come come over here, Rocky Marzan. He just fought. Rocky um, Marzan. He just huh? fought Friday night in Mexico. Won by first round KO. Uh, he's two, and two knockouts right now. 122 pounder, and he's back in the gym on Monday. Won by knockout on Saturday. Back in the gym on Monday. That's what we're about. Nice. Let me just ask real quick. So, who some of the fighters that inspired you coming up, man? Uh, definitely Floyd Mayweather. You know, I'm from the East Coast. I'm originally from New York, but um, I lived a lot of my life in Pennsylvania. Scranton, Pennsylvania, but I traveled to Philadelphia, which was a two-hour drive just to get sparring, just to uh, educate myself more of the sport of boxing, Philadelphia. And um, I made it here to Vegas, so just working hard and play me with you know what I'm saying? That's what it is. Let everybody know if they want to follow you, how they can follow you. You can follow me on Instagram, Rocky underscore Marzan, R-O-C-K-Y underscore M-A-R-Z-A-N. Rocky Marzan, I like that name, man. He's got a lot of like power, 122 pounder. He hits very hard, and you know he's a dedicated uh, young fighter, and, and he's he's gonna be a force to be reckoned with in the next year to year and a half. Nice, man. Let me get your thoughts on these um, last weekend fights, or just the one, the main one, Lomachenko versus Mariaga. What was your thoughts? You know, Lomachenko's great. You know, at least he got hit a little bit. It was a rough fight, but he's great. You know. Um, as expected, you know, we, uh, we expected a stoppage and we got it. Uh, do you think uh, he should fight? Because Rigo is aggressively calling him out. Mikey Garcia is aggressively calling him out. Where should he go, man? I, mean, I would like to see the Mikey Garcia fight because Mikey Garcia throws a lot of punches. He comes forward. And, you know, it'll be a nice contrast in styles. And Mikey Garcia is hot right now. He just beat Broner, so he definitely deserves the opportunity. What happened to Broner, man, in that fight? I'm not even sure. Um, I'm not sure what happened. Um, I had better expectations of him, but you know, Garcia, he's the man. He what, 37 and 0 now, 33 KOs. He proved he's the man. Number no, congratulations to him and his brother who trains him in his whole camp. Vernon needs to really reassess what he's doing and 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 try to do one more comeback or hang him up because you know he can't keep 
doing all that talk and not, and not uh, being productive. So I, I really would like for him to, you know, get back in the gym for about six, seven months, working hard, and then get back in there and give him one more shot. But I think he needs a little humility uh, to, to really improve.